saying he did, I'm saying according to your case, he asked for it a month later on 25th of May, isn't it? Yeah. All this time you're holding the money? I was not holding the money. Uh -huh. The whole amount I gave it to my dad. I told you the operator business. Yes. So I gave them the whole amount okay. to keep safe. So I, I have the greatest respect for you, greatest possible respect for you, uh, Mr. Dennis. But when you cry and say, I sold my saloon, you are selling saloon from your own mind that a bribe might be required. Dr. Mondad is not the one who told you I need money. And when you are selling it, it was not because Monda told you to, to sell your saloon. As I stated earlier, I did not know any communication yes. between my dad. So why are you crying? Why are you crying okay. and it's not Dr. Monda who told you to sell your saloon or okay. forced you to sell your saloon? Where? He had not told you to give him any bribe. So where is my business? Where did it go to? Yeah, that. When you sold it on 20th, Dr. Monda had not spoken to you, had he? Okay, we are, okay. where are the proceedings? Okay, the anyway, I think I've made my point to the Senate. Yes. I'd like to move on to a different issue. Mm. And I probably just want to finish because I know you need, uh, your colleagues need time. Um, so you said you, Dr. Monda also threatened you, isn't it? Yes. That's the other count against Dr. Monda. Now, we are agreed, Doctor, you don't, you didn't, you never spoke with Dr. Monda at any point on phone, isn't it? Uh, every communication was done through my dad. Your father. Yes. And so even the threat was, came through your father? No, this was, uh, it came through now, uh, it's uh, Honorable Siocha. Uh, whom I had reported the issue to, yes. and uh, told me to write a formal statement. No, no, I don't know if you are mixing the issues. Yes. We are talking about being threatened. Yes. We are in agreement this far that there was no communication between you and Dr. Monda. Every time you needed to communicate with Dr. Monda, you do it through your father, isn't yes. it? Yes. Yeah. So the question is, you, at a certain point, labor under the feeling that you have been threatened. That feeling was communicated to you by your father, or by who, or by what? You know, when I told my dad I want to make a formal complaint, it was not of the idea. Please just answer the question yes. directly. It is your father who told you. Yeah, Dr. Through... Monda is very upset and uh, say, has threatened your life. Uh, he did not say, OK, I got the information from my dad. Yes. And also got so the Senate can then rest and say, knowing that the point that you are threatened was communicated to you by your father, that it came from Dr. Monda, isn't yes. it? Yes. Okay. Now that's good enough. I want to move on from there. Now, look at paragraph uh, paragraph 17. I have two last issues I want to discuss. Okay. First of all, paragraph 12. You have nothing to show that any 300,000 was given to Dr. Monda, do you? Other than saying it, other than word of mouth, no, you don't have. Yes. And you are your witness for the point that three hundred thousand was given to Dr. Monda is your father, Mr. Joseph Misat, isn't it? Yes, I was with my he dad. He was. He was. And he will come and testify and say, yeah. "I was with my son when we gave Dr. Monda the money." Yes, I was with him. Okay. Now, the, let's move on to paragraph seventeen. You say I informed my father and the deputy governor of my intention. No, 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 paragraph 15. You say that I thereafter wrote a demand letter to the deputy governor. Could you confirm that in the totality of the documents you've brought, you've not given us a copy of that demand letter? What, uh, sorry, what I did after the complaint to the Honorable Siocha, Wigley Siocha? No, no, I'm just asking. Yes. We have documents here which the Senate is looking at us. You've seen we've gone through. That letter is not amongst the letters. There is no demand letter, isn't it, that you've brought to this? Senate or to the assembly, isn't it? I gave the copy to Honorable Siocha. And so you don't know, it's, it's Mr. Siocha, Honorable Siocha will explain it, eh? Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, let's move on. Then you reported to EACC, isn't it? Yes, I did. Now, I would like you to, Honorable Members, I want to refer to my, our bundle, DG's bundle, page 16, where the letter of EACC is. Now, could you confirm that this is not the letter of complaint? This letter at page 16. Uh, why do they keep taking away the document from you, Dennis? Okay, you're at page 16. 
So page 16 is a letter dated 6th of February 2024 delivered to the, to the ESCC on 20th of February, isn't it? Yes. Okay. Now, in that letter, that's not the letter you used to make your complaint, isn't it? This is a follow-up letter. Let's just go direct like that. This is a follow-up letter. Okay. Yeah. Have you brought this same this Senate a copy of your letter of complaint tabulating the issues you have complained against Dr. The, the complaints were recorded. Yes. And there was no uh, end document given. So, so you may, ESCC, you have yeah. nothing to show it? Yeah, it's only the recording that they did at the ESCC. Okay. Yes. And you have no reference number? We actually, we, there was no reference number given. Now, this Senate is investigative in this kind of matters and might want to know whether that report was made. Could you tell this uh, Senate, what day did you make this report to ESCC? It was before this. Uh, no, I'm saying, so I you cannot. were prepared to make this case. Mm -hmm. You're saying you reported to ESCC. Could you tell us, was it on 14th of February 2023 or 16th or whichever date? Could you give us a specific date? Or you don't, you don't have a date? I cannot remember the specific okay. date. Now, uh, if this, which, which place did you report this to? ESCC. Integr Where? Integrity. Integrity House. Yes. Okay. Yeah. And your statement is at Integrity House. Yes. Okay. Yes. So if the Senate wants to summon somebody to confirm that, who did you record your statement with? Give us a name. Oh, I don't know the name, but after I made the name either. Uh, after I made the complaint, and I just answer the question directly yes. so that we move. You don't have the name. You don't have a name. It, yeah, I, I remember she was a lady, but I don't know. Remember the name? Sorry, you? She was a lady. She was a lady. Yes, but right I don't handed know. or left handed? Oh, you don't know. I cannot tell. Okay, but yeah. you don't know the name. You don't know the date, mm -hmm. and you have no copy of any any piece of any complaint. Okay, I would like then to move on to a different issue as I close. What is your wish from this uh, Senate? Your wish is that uh, you get back your money. Is that, is that what you want this Senate to say? What is your wish? You know, my wish uh, as a young uh, graduate yes. uh, is just a representation yes. of the exploits that no, you No, no, you cried about through. your money. You cried about your money. And so is it your point that you want the DG to be punished? You want him to lose his job? Or you want refund of your money? What is your what is when, what is it you want this when, to do? Uh, I complained. I made a complaint to the. Uh, you are not answering yes. my question. I wanted back my money. You want back your money? Yes. And your expectation is that this senate will tell the DG to give you back your money? So okay. So let me ask you differently. Yeah. Have you filed a civil suit? Sorry. For refund of your money? No. And is it your interest that your your father's your father's friend be punished? Is your point that I want punishment for him? But that's not your interest. Your interest is money or punishment? My interest uh, is not only money. Yes. It's my long-term savings that I've made over the period of years. Yes, that's the same point. You want yes. money. Yes. Yes, and this is just a, a representation of the youth. Yes. So uh, I'm asking of you. Of the exploits we are going through, uh, these politicians who ask favors in return of jobs. So I'm just a representative of the youth. Yes. Yeah. So you've come to represent the youth in making this complaint? Um, I actually say yes, you've and, come and if there are other youths out there okay. who have So you've not... come here on behalf of the youth? Sorry? You have come on behalf of other youth? Uh, this was on my... Please actually, answer my question, my, yes or no. You've come on behalf of other youth? It's both. Okay. And your yes. tears this, this afternoon is also for the rest of the youth? It was my lifetime savings. Is for the baby I lost. Now let's look at let's process. look at page 15 of your of your of the DG's bundle, which is your letter of complaint. Which? Page 15 of that same bundle. Page 15, honourable members. At page 15, you've said the only. Inter Are you at page 15? This one. Yes, 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 that one, yes. You said, I have written to you because the deputy governor is acting